Hi, today I'm going to show you how to make um, a simple, quick and easy stepper card using the free gift items from the Crafting with Hunky Dory magazine um, using the Just Because free gifts. So I'm going to first of all make the um, stepper. So I've already um, cut this down to um, four by two notches under six. I'm going to get the adorable scoreboard. It's just here. And then I'm actually going to take the tool out and score it at four and a half centimetres and nine to give the perfect step. I'm going to fold that and just give it a really good crease with the score tool and then this bit here as well. So this part becomes the step and that just sits underneath the, underneath the card blank here. Perfect. So I'm going to um, put that on with a bit of construction glue. Um, so you just need to just glue this tab in place um, and it's going to be a tent fold. Yep. And then just glue that tab onto there and just make sure it's really secure. And then, perfect. And then I'm going to do my matting and layering with my Miri um, using some double sided tape. Then we are going to then take the um, cardstock to make our mats. So I'm just going to get the paper trimmer. And then um, the, I'm just going to chop this border off here because we're not going to use that on this bit. And then just using the polka dot pattern, I'm just going to um, cut that to... Um, two notches under the six on each side so that it leaves a really nice mirror border. Um, but you'll still be able to see that really nice polka dot pattern. So I'm just going to again just get some double sided tape um, and just make a really quick mat for that. And then I'm going to then take the um, floral um, piece of the same cardstock, but just with that border on, um, just to give it a little bit of contrast. Um, so, yeah, that is two. I'm just going to, again, just going to go um, two notches under the two. And then... Um, two notches under the six as well. And again, I'm just gonna mat and layer that with some double-sided tape. Perfect. And then I've got um, a few pages of the little book. I think it comes with six of each one, six. And then I'm just gonna do a bit of decoupage on here. Um, so that's gonna be my base layer. And then I'm just gonna cut um, slightly smaller like each time um, in a sort of traditional decoupage style.
Okay, so you've got all your layers there. Um, and then I'm just going to pop these onto the base layer um, with just some foam pads. So I'm using the big square ones for just like maximum coverage on the bigger layers. Perfect, and then you get all the you get all the depth there and like the dimension of it. Perfect. So I'm actually just going to mat that onto a little piece of um, adorable scoreable in the pink, and I am going to use construction glue. Um, just to really quickly mat and layer that. Brilliant. And then I'm going to just stick that onto the base. Um, again, I will just pop some construction glue on that because it's um, brilliant. And then I'm going to just stick that onto the base. Um, again, I will just pop some construction glue on that because just put it in the center of the card. Brilliant. And then this is where the toppers come in. So I am going to use the border strip. secure that down and then I've used for the front I've used these three small square toppers um, as a trio and they've each got a really cute sentiment on there um, so there's can I just say hello there I'm wishing you a lovely day And then just secure those onto the card. And I am just going to put another sentiment on the top bit. So I'm going to go with the just for you. as well so I'm just going to use um, one of the small strips for the sentiment and I'm just going to pop that on there just so that when the card stands you'll be able to see it and again I'm going to cut a small foam pad for the little flower chop into that a bit further perfect and then you can finish it off with some um, pearl gemstones so you can use quite a lot of there's quite a lot of different colors in here but these are just the pink ones And just pop three of those in a line down there and that is all done 